Joining two surfaces together doesn't sound complicated, but when performance is key, you could be led into all different directions. In this video, we're going to talk about the seven types of adhesive bonding materials, as well as what you should know about bonding before choosing the material. The seven common types of adhesive bonding materials are glue, adhesive tape, adhesive film, hot melt, epoxy, paste, and spray adhesive. Glue is an adhesive that historically created relatively weak bonds, but recent innovations, including self-curing adhesives, have made glue a preferred material for many applications. Glues can effectively bond metal to dissimilar materials. Application can be tricky, and expensive machinery is often preferred. It's good to keep in mind that your bond can fail under prolonged heat or weathering. Adhesive tape is customizable into various sizes, shapes, and formats, offering versatility in bonding to similar surfaces and objects. It tends to have more adhesive and thicker construction compared to an adhesive film. Adhesive tape provides structural stability with even force distribution, reducing stress points and increasing shear strength. It is aesthetically pleasing, creating a tight, low-profile connection without adding bulk. Adhesive film is a thin layer of high-performing bonding agent on a backing material. Creating a strong bond, some adhesive films are moisture activated or heat activated, while others are pressure sensitive. They usually do not contain liquids, allowing for indefinite storage. While modern innovations have transformed weak adhesive films into durable materials, most now use self-curing adhesives, requiring extra curing time. Hot melt adhesives are heat activated adhesives that are used for very specific applications. These adhesives come in many different forms from sticks, cartridges, or pellets, making them very easy to store and handle. Heat activated adhesives are great on surfaces where films tend to struggle, such as aluminum foil, polyurethane, PVC, and rubber. Epoxy is a hard and durable adhesive commonly used for bonding various substrates. It is typically a two-part system formulated for diverse applications, cure speeds, and performance in extreme environments. Epoxies are known for their strength and toughness, making them suitable for joining structural materials such as plywood. However, they can be challenging to apply and may require automated machines. Pastes come in sealed containers and they are used to spread across surfaces when making bonds. Adhesive manufacturers have created one-part and two-part paste formulations for strong bonds on rubbers, metals, woods, plastics, and masonry. Spray adhesive is typically used to bond materials like paper, fabrics, foams, and felt. Specialty contact adhesives extend to more demanding projects involving metal, plastic sheet laminates, and wood. The application can be challenging, requiring a well-ventilated room and specialized applicators, either manual or automatic. Repositioning the substrate becomes impossible after the solvent completely evaporates. Understanding the advantages of adhesive bonding materials is crucial. These materials can reduce labor costs by eliminating the need for drilling holes while decreasing weight and energy use with thin and light materials. They also evenly distribute stress across the bond. Bond dissimilar materials act as both a sealant and an adhesive simultaneously and reduce vibration in the final product. The choice of materials should consider the specific characteristics of substrates, including their surface energy. Converters play a crucial role in helping select the right adhesive bonding materials based on their design manufacturability. They assist in defining a strategy and production process to create effective parts while avoiding common errors. Experienced converters guide the adhesive selection process, especially for substrates, with varying surface energies. Their expertise helps navigate challenges, ensuring the successful implementation of adhesive bonding solutions in product manufacturing. If you have any questions, feel free to visit our learning center on our website or reach out to us directly. Thanks for watching.